So do you like or hate spiders? Either way, I do not like spiders, I'll admit that. But let's go on with Pretty Cure by talking about Yes Pretty Cure 5 spider villain with an iconic spider name, Arachnia. So let's begin. Arachnia is a villain in Yes Pretty Cure 5, along with Hadania. They are the only female employees of the Nightmare Company. Hadania comes from the fourth season of Pretty Cure, Yes Pretty Cure 5. She made her debut in episode 4 of the series, and she comes from Nightmare. Her role is that of a villain, and her theme is spiders, with her theme color being purple. She has the power to create koanas and cobwebs to trap her victims. She was voiced by Yoko Somi in Japanese and Wevelec Blanche in the French dub. Arachne appears as a woman with short purplish pink hair wearing a business office dress that's red. Her true form is that of a humanoid spider with six legs on her back. Arachnia is overconfident that her abilities can handle the cures easily. Each defeat is a stab to her pride, which makes her become desperate to defeat them no matter what it takes. She was hired by Bumby to get the Dream Collect. After hearing her express for her desire to steal the Dream Collect, Arachnia then chased it down Nozomi and succeeded. However, she also caught Komachi as well. Nozomi tried to run, but Arachnia kept pursuing her. When Nozomi finally transformed, Arachnia started to shoot webs at the two girls. But when Aurora had arrived with Coco as well, once Kamachi gained her pretty cure powers, Arachnia became angry and made a koana before leaving. Upon her return, Arachnia was scolded by Bumby. Arachnia asked for another chance, however, Bumby refused and told her to go on a vacation while he fought the cures instead. Bumby then opened a hole beneath her feet for Arachnia to fall into as seen in episode 5. When Bumby was disappointed in his efforts to steal the Dream Collect, so he ordered Arachnia to steal it, then which she accepted. She attacked the cures, however, her Kwaina was purified so she escaped. In the next episode, Arachnia was told by Koaino, who wanted the Dream Collect, Arachnia then asked for another chance in which she used Mika as bait so the Cures would have to hand over the Dream Collect. However, her plan failed as the Cures came up with a plan to save Mika. During her final battle in episode 30, Arachnia asked for the Black Paper so she can defeat the Cures once and for all. She doubted her decision, especially since Bumby warned her about the consequences. She, but she believed using it was the right choice to make her nightmare. She confronted the Kiris with her rage at than usual, and nearly defeated them until Nozomi arrived. All five Kiris were about to be defeated by Arachnia when she finally used the black paper, which turned herself into a powerful monster. Furthermore, injuring the Cures, after Milk conveyed her true feelings and helped the, the Cures with her willpower, Five Explosion eventually defeated Arachnia, killing her for good. Arachnia returns in Pretty Cure All-Stars DX2 as one of Bottom's servants. She appeared with Carrion to trap Tubomi and Erika, but were defeated by the Fresh Cures. Arachnia's name comes from Arachnid, a genius of spiders. Okay, and that is Arachnia. Not a lot of fur on her, but I hope you liked the information. Next time, we'll talk about Bumby, so see you next time.